Hi, I'm Dr. Sanjay Panikkar. I founded Amrita Homeopathy in 1997 in a small town in Kerala. Now we are placed at Bangalore, at Koramangala and at Marathalli. My clinic is named as Amrita Homeopathy and uh, we specialize in hair and skin problems, respiratory problems, pediatrics, allergies, infertility, varicocele and hepatitis B. So when you have jaundice, the easiest way for you to identify that you have jaundice is just look upward in front of a mirror you stand in front of a mirror look upward and just pull the upper eyelid a little above and and then you can see when your chin is up and you look down at the same time look at the mirror you can see the upper part above the eyeball the whitish color of the sclera or the conjunctiva becomes yellowish in jaundice that's the easiest way you can identify it but for that you will have to train your eyes to see the image in the mirror and look at the upper part and at the same time exposing it with your hand so that way you know that the sclera get turning yellow happens only in jaundice but what are the symptoms how do you know whether it could possibly be jaundice fever is the most common symptom and liver is affected here and so your bilirubin will be going up a bilirubin more than 1.2 to 2 1.2 to 2 can be indication of mild jaundice when it goes above 2 the skin becomes more and more yellow if you press your skin and remove it usually a pale color comes and it turns back to normal skin but in jaundice the skin becomes slightly yellow there instead of pale it becomes slightly yellow there and the urine will be darker stool will be pale stool fever will be there extreme weakness extreme weakness that you cannot even walk walk a few steps in your own house you may feel like sitting down or lying down that much weakness is what is seen in jaundice because liver is affected wherever the liver is affected weakness is extreme and then you will have abdominal pain because liver is affected especially in the right side of the upper part of the abdomen you may have pain can be the whole abdomen also because you will also have nausea vomiting sometime even lose motions in certain patients so these are the symptoms of jaundice this is how you know you have jaundice in native uh, places they usually take a little urine put a little boiled rice white rice boiled or put a drop of urine on that and if it turns yellowish in color they say that it is jaundice so this is a simple way in which in villages many people are said to diagnose but that is not confirmed so the easier way is look at the mirror see the upper part of your sclera and if it is yellow then it's possibly jaundice check your bilirubin levels in your blood test that will give you a confirmation the most important remedy in homeopathy as far as jaundice is concerned is chelidonium and cardus marianus these two remedies are excellent in treating jaundice cardus marianus milk thistle is uh, known throughout the world even in ayurveda they use this particular medicine for the treatment of uh, jaundice chilon is another homeopathic remedy which is used for jaundice treatment leptandra is a, another medicine we have medicines like phosphorus nakswamika and lycopodium which are again other remedies which are used in the treatment of jaundice